Yeah, I know we get crazy on the show. Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Come Back to Endless Uploads. Welcome to another episode of Camera and Freak Out. Today's show features some of the best public freak out videos caught on camera, entitled Karen's Totally Losing Their Sh and more. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, so this next Amazon employee was just trying to do her job when this crazy Karen appeared out of nowhere to make her life extremely stressful. So let's check out the full video. You already know I'm gonna need you guys, so let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. And if you like watching these type of crazy videos all day, 24 seven, make sure to hit that bell for notifications and join the family. You are now watching Endless Uploads. Do you know that it says resident parking only? It's, I'm speaking to you. Have a nice day. So you know I've got all your information. In. That's fine. It's, it's a parking lot. I ain't did no. nothing wrong. Yes, you did something wrong. What'd I do? You were extremely rude. You made me wait. It says condo parking only. You've taken two spots. And there's plenty of parking over there. Okay, so why didn't you park over there? I live here. Okay, says, I'm just delivering a package. I know, but you don't have to be rude about it. You I don't have to rude. You don't have to take two spots, and you don't have to continue to make someone wait. Okay. You yep. saw me pulling in. Have a nice day. More information than that. Yeah, this is what I have to deal with at work. <laughs> but you're able to talk on the phone while you're at work. That's so interesting. Yeah, because you was recording me. So I'm recording you now. You can report me. What What are you reporting? That's not recording. Great. So I'm trying to get information and you are not providing it. I like thought you'd go through the Amazon app. Nope. I need to know your name or ID number. I need to know your supervisor. My name, name is Sharon Smith. Okay. I'm going to just go ahead and put that down. Sharon Smith. All right. I can't give you the other information because I don't know the other information. Uh, I doubt that. But you can go through the Amazon app, file, uh, file a complaint, and no, okay. it'll be like that. Okay. That's it. That's not going to work. You, okay. don't, you don't recognize who you're speaking with, do you? No, I really, sure don't, don't. I really don't care. I know you don't. Uh, so this next guy has an epic meltdown at the store, and that's when things got ugly really quick. Let's check it out. A nigga that sleep with 30. Ain't did nothing wrong. Call him, nigga. Fuck I look like. Randy, you Don't tell me that I stole. Did you see it, bro? Thank you, bro. Thank you. I got, I got a witness right here. Thank you. I got another witness right there on camera. Did nothing wrong. You don't fuck about none of that. I didn't do anything wrong. Yep, yellow hoodie. Mom hair. Sexy little motherfucker. Uh, uh, chiseled out. Handsome bronze figure. Like a god. Fuck you talking about. I don't know. Yeah, you yeah, you go know. They'll know when they get here. Tell them call all that boy. Tell them to bring them all. Tell them to bring the whole cavalry. Give a fuck, I didn't do nothing wrong. I ain't going nowhere. Tell them they ain't gotta worry about it. I ain't gonna run. I ain't did nothing wrong. Ain't nobody gotta run. Yep. Where you at? These motherfuckers got me fucked up. I'm talking about you know, it's the manager, man. I don't want to talk to you because I want to say it one time, no, three talking to the twerk, if you say it once. So I pass out. Go get the manager or the charge nurse. I'm going to tell you and her at the same time, one time. What do you want? No, I'm not going back down in the hallway because I just came from out of there. And if I had stayed there, I probably would have died. Go get her. Miss. What's about to happen is a goddamn lawsuit. If you don't stop talking to me and take your ass back, they ain't gonna get your purse. I'm not getting anybody to see where you're supposed to be. I'm where I'm supposed to be right here because y'all left me in the hallway over there to die. I'm not going back in that fucking hallway. You have the right to refuse the testimony. I bet you better go get me some goddamn medical help. I bet you that. Back there or outside the sick. I'll be glad to get the supervisor. Yeah, get her. Go get her. I'm not 
Get off the phone, whoever that is. No, get off the phone. Get off the phone. No, get off the phone. Get ready to call the police and now my one. They refusing me medical attention from they sit. All right, so in this next clip, this woman went to the toe with employees at this BMW hey, you, dealership. I'm calling, I'm calling. He's got ugly. Ugly quits. Now, check this out. Let us know in the comments who do you feel like is right or wrong in this whole crazy situation. This is endless. Since you said don't come back here no more, come on. And call your lawyer, please. I'm calling. I'm calling. Since he on that dumb ass move. He kicking us out of BMW after they tow up the car no. after six months. Get out, get out or I'm calling the cops. Call you call you want, we come and get the car. Right, I'm calling the cops right now if you don't leave. I need my paper. I'm not leaving yes, from you. Yes, we need receipts. I need my damn paperwork. Right, gonna, I'm going to call nah, the cops. go get my paperwork. You keep cursing in here in front of these people, no, I will call the cops. I'm cursing the people. I'm cursing to you. Yeah. Call, get my paperwork. They put it together with the other paperwork. It's probably in the car. Let me see. It's probably on the front seat of okay. the car. Let's see. This is the BMW place. We getting kicked out. We come and pick up a car after six months. By the new service manager. <laughs> oh my god. You can leave now. Get off of my car. Put you out of here. Now. You can leave. If you don't leave, I'm calling the cops right now. You call the cops, I do the computer. It's fine with me. You really don't know who I am. Yes. <laughs> he's calling the police because he's kicking us off the lot because they mess up my girl car after six, seven months. <laughs> what? Boss Motors, BMW. Yeah, like the cop is not Guys, make sure to let us know in the comments what would you do if you had a crazy Karen as a neighbor? Let's check it out. I suggest you back up out of my space. I suggest you back. This is my car. It's all right, just don't come in my face with that phone. You can come in my face if I want. You'll come by you my car. You cannot come in I my face. I can come by your face. No, you can't. Oh, no, yes, I can. No, you can't. Keep in my face, and you're going to find you're trouble. You're pushing me? You're, you're pushing in me? my face. You're Get away. You're in my face. Get away. Did you hear what I said? Get away. Thank okay. me. I'm calling the cops right You now. go right ahead. I didn't do nothing. You did. You no, me. I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. It's surveillance. No, it's not. Because yes, it I told you to get out I of my told, space. I told you to get out of my, out of my car. I'm not in by your you're car. Not in my car. So what? Public street, dumbass. Dumbass, it's my car. Yeah, so? Okay. Get away from my car. Okay. 
Well, it's not high grade harassment. That's not the definition of that. Yeah. But. All right, so in this next clip, these Burger King employees get into a very heated confrontation, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full video, and I'm going to need you guys to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. Let's check it out. I'm not trying to make this hard. I want you to go home. I don't care if I have to be here until 12. Stop trying to clock back in. I want you to clock out and leave the store. So what you going to do if I don't? Huh? What you going to do if I don't? I'm going to call Michelle and tell her to get you the fuck out of here. Okay, I'm going to call Michelle myself. Like, stop playing with me. You being ignorant. Bro, come on. You want to see some potters. Come on. Oh, my God, man. For real, like, stop playing with me on the cool. Because you don't even supposed to be here, my nigga. All the money you just sold, like, stop fucking playing with me. Oh, my God. What you fucking talking about? Oh my God, girl, just get the fuck out of the car. I'm not, what you gonna do? I'm not. No, we, okay. Exactly, I'm you're not. you're not getting any hours. I'm not worried about no hours, but you ain't gonna make me leave. This is my second job, y'all motherfuckers okay. leave me. This if you wanna be technical, like don't play with me, cause I will do it up to your bitch ass and leave. Okay, well just what? go. Just go, man. I'm not going nowhere, like, I'm cool, I will make my dude come up and step the fuck out to you. Know? Mm. For what? You know he will. For what? You know he will. Yeah, oh, there's, there's a sign on the door that say that, sir. Oh, well, too late, I already got it. Sir, sir, no video, no, no, sir, no, I, no sir can you get that? Can you pull it? Oh, no, 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 I get your hand off of them, man. You touch them, man. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing. Uh, so this next woman gets into a very heated conversation with this door dasher, and it looks like it was almost time to whoop some ass. So let's check out the full video, and I'ma definitely need someone to translate what's going on in this video. And if you like watching this type of content, make sure to hit that bell for notifications and subscribe to our channel so you do not miss out when we post new videos. I'm telling y'all, no other channel is showing y'all this type of crazy content, man. So if y'all like seeing crazy stuff 24/7 like we do. You already know the tune in the endless uploads. Let's check it out.
Jalan Jamal boleh saya. Ya I call the police here. This is no good. Apa nama loco, loco ya. Man, if YouTube wasn't so scary, man, we'd we'll be showing y'all all the crazy fights, bro. Y'all know they got policies. So this next guy was just trying to do his job when this crazy Karen appeared out of nowhere to make his life extremely stressful. Let's check it out. You are repairing other people's vehicles in your neighborhood, in your house, and that's against the bylaws, all right? So. This is my vehicle right here, and this vehicle behind me is mine, and that one is mine, oh, and that one is also. Yes, they are. If I were to they run are. a vehicle check on that, you can do whatever it is you want to do, lady. Okay, but do me a favor, mind your own business and stay on your side of the street. You're bringing down the property values of all everybody around here. Is it really me, or yes, is it you? you? Are you can do anything you want. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to. You look like a crazy person right now. I want you to know. You look like a crazy okay. person. Okay. All right. Stop. That. All right. Keep it up. Keep it up. It's called harassment. Oh, what do you do when you go mm -hmm. out at four o'clock in the morning and, or twelve o'clock in the morning? I work at night. I work at night. Well, that's nice. Okay. Well, I don't know what you do. But okay. It doesn't matter. You're right. It doesn't matter. What, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter to me. I work what you at night. Do, okay. But the fact is, that is a car right here. That is a. It's a some kind of a bought car. Didn't you buy your car? Do you buy all these cars? Yes. Are all these cars in your name? Yes. Would yes. you be willing to give me the information on I don't have to give you nothing. Well, okay. I can guarantee you. You're in here, you're repairing vehicles, and it's against the bylaws. No, that's a hobby of mine. I repair my own stuff. It's not a hobby. It's a business. And you're not supposed to have it as a business. I don't know anything about anybody's business, but but my own business. I mind my own business, and why don't you why don't you mind your own business? Okay. No. Okay. Why don't you mind your own business? And why don't you go why don't you go look up the definition of harassment? Okay. Hey friend. Hey friend. Is she with you? Can you grab her, man? No. Please. No. I. Please. Okay. Great. Great. I own my house too. I own my house too. Okay. All right. That's fine. That's fine. You're not supposed to be having a business out okay. of your house. All right. And fine. You have it. Fine. And you know what? You're not supposed to be harassing your neighbors. You're not supposed to be harassing your neighbors. I'm not harassing. Yeah, you, you are. You are. You are. You are. You are. I don't. I don't have any kind of business running out of here. Someplace else. I'm not running any kind of business out of here. Okay. All right. Have a great day. Karen gets into a very heated confrontation with the street vendor, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full clip. You guys make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. Because I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what it is about these street vendors that get these Karens so damn heated. Let's check it out. Hey. Hey, can you move my property? <laughs> you know what I asked that? Hey. Oh, you're on video. Go. He's a minor. Watch. He's a minor? Yes. Go, come, come. Right now. Yeah, watch. No, watch. He's gonna come. Come. He's gonna come. Right now. You're a minor? You're a minor. He's a minor. Come, come, right now. Go, come, come. Go. You call him. No, you call. Just move your stuff. Okay, but, but what? Go, come, come. What promise you want? You're telling me he's a minor? Go, 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 go. Yeah. Why you want? Call the cops. Why you want? Hey. You're a minor? Yeah, Call right. the cops! Okay. Call the cops right now! He's a minor? Call the cops! Call the cops! He's just threatening He's a minor! So what? Go call the cops! Okay, call the cops! 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 Call the cops!
<laughs> All right, so our next care neighbor is getting into a very heated confrontation, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. Let's check it out. Good morning. How you doing? Just make I'm sure. I'm walking up the street, and you. This is how you greet me. Good make morning. Sure. You don't get that close to my car no more. I'm sitting in my driveway, and you have nothing that you need to talk to me about. Good morning. How are you? I don't care about you? you videoing me. I'm wonderful. How are you doing today, Lisa? You was this close from hitting my okay. car. But I didn't. Literally. And I didn't. So why did you get that close to my car? You weren't even out here. Why did you get that close? This Do close. you think it was intentional? You just want to speak to me. Why did you get this we close We haven't to talked my in car? so long. You What's been going on? How on you doing? Brakes. You doing okay? You had a slam on your How you doing? You doing don't, all right? You not, don't fuck with my you daughter. You doing okay? Don't fuck with I'm my daughter. I'm just trying to figure out what's going on. Bitch, I, don't fuck with my daughter. Good morning. I'm don't walking up this street. Daughter, bitch. This is great. You doing okay? Well, you have a great day. I got to get to work. And you have a good one. You came this close. All right. Thanks. Because, bitch, I was ready to beat your ass in the motherfucking ground. I was Thank ready you. to beat your ass. Thank you. You yeah. came this close. Okay. Yeah. I got you on camera. I'm walking. I'm walking up to my door. Yeah, you on my camera. I'm walking up to my door on my property. Have a good day, You're on Lisa. My camera this close. Have Bitch, a great I day, Lisa. Hit my car. On this I day, August thirtieth. Have a great camera, day. This motherfucker. You want? Yeah, I ain't none of this shit. I'm not about none of this drama. Get back to the car. If you touch me again, I'm gonna Let's get it, man. Let's do it. Hey, guys, don't forget to hit that bell for notifications and subscribe to our crazy channel if you like seeing videos like this one. This is crazy. All right, so this next woman has an epic meltdown at the store after she got cut in line and the cashier did nothing about it. So let's check out the full video. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this situation right here. Do you feel like she was doing too much or did she have a valid point? Let's check it out. I'm 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 uh -oh. Now, right and right and wrong, what's wrong? I'm with the kids all the time. Eat the chill. What's wrong with y'all? This ain't y'all world. I don't know that. Eat the chill. Don't worry about it. It is what it is. No love in this world. No love. No love. What's wrong with being kind and considerate of others? Nothing. Ah, uh, so this next Uber driver gets into a very heated back and forth with this Karen after he told her that she would need a car seat in order for her three-year-old to ride in this Uber. But Karen wasn't trying to hear it, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full video, and I'm gonna definitely need you guys to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here you are now watching endless uploads you don't know the requirements uh, I, you don't know none of that okay why don't you want to have a car seat for the three-year-old because she doesn't need one the law says she does well guess what mm -hmm. i have been in plenty of ubers it doesn't matter what other Ubers do. I right. follow the law. You have your own preference. And there that's you fine. go. And no, it's the law. It's the law. 
But I don't want her day, getting in an accident with me. If we get in so an accident, cool. if we get it's in an accident, we, I go to jail and you go to jail. There you go. I'm talking, I'm reporting you. I'm doing all that. Oh, that's fine. And I hope the police pull up so they can give me a ride home because at this. Oh, that's at this fine. Moment, they might get, they might give you a ride to to jail. Oh uh, well, yeah. Okay. And CPS. Okay. You don't seem to be caring about the safety because of your what child. Because you're saying it doesn't make any sense, sir. What? A child seat for a child? No, why? You're not making no sense. But it's cool. What? That we need to follow the law? Listen, they don't know how... It, listen, car seats is height requirement. H. How do you know that H. she's not tall enough? Because the lady in 911 said so. Do you know her it's height? Law. Did you tell the lady I can her see, height? I can see how little she is. How? Like, how tall is she? I don't care how tall is she. No, that she makes a difference. She looks like two feet tall. While you're talking, it makes a difference with the weight. It makes a difference with the height. And it makes a difference with the age. <laughs> don't sit oh here and tell me what I know. Well, you don't seem to know much. Yeah. He's like, tell me, talking at me, cussing at me. This owner right here of this store was cussing at me as an employee. I work very hard at this store location. My name is Kayla, and I will not have this owner of this store cussing at me. I work very hard. Does everybody agree? Yeah. Yes, yeah. everybody agrees here that I work very hard. I'm very going to HR. That's ridiculous. Wow. Uh, so our next crazy Karens go toe to toe at this liquor store. Let's jump right into it. All right, all right. That, so that we all know and we're all aware. Of what? That I had to make another trip coming back here due to your suggestion. And I just want to make and sure to that no we too. can return the and bottle and so that I can no get the ones that I want. And just like me. I know. I'm not here to argue, Tracy. Yeah. This is a business. Um, I'm trying to see. Is that, no. Look, y'all can figure it out. Just give me my bottle and keep the change. I really don't care about two dollars. Cause there's no receipt in my car. I never even got up the, the car. <laughs> this is crazy. Anything's possible, I know that. <laughs> Thank you so much. Keep the receipt, wait, all right? Wait, wait, what's wrong with you? Y'all, no, something yeah, wrong with y'all. Maybe you it's y'all standing up to, all need day need long. You need, Go ahead. you need to go to church. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you do. You definitely need church. You need Jesus. Oh, yeah? Because you know what? Uh -huh. The fact that you come here all the time and act the way you act, is, is you need Jesus. Hey, look, you can run the cameras yeah. back. I'm always I'm professional. I'm always professional. And guess what? The proof is in the pudding. We'll see who needs what. <laughs> All right, so these next guys get into a very heated confrontation with these fast food employees. And I'm telling you guys, you will not believe what happens next. So let's check out the full video. And I'm gonna definitely need you guys to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. Let's check it out. So this lady's refusing to give us our pop that we paid for. So we can't get our Coke that we paid for? Okay, can we, get a, can we please get our Coke that we paid for? Can we please get our coke that we pay for? We just want our pop. Can we get our coke? Are we gonna hold up the line all night till we get our coke? We're gonna hold up the line until we get our coke. Can you give us our for. pop? You in there talking about our gift card. You're in there talking about our gift card. Like, what's wrong with the gift card? I didn't say nothing to I heard you talking about our gift card. Hey, my man, I'm a grown ass man. Can we can just get, get our coke? pop? My man, can I get my coke, get bro? Get my money back then. We just want our pop. Well, can I get my money back? Can I get my money back? Well, can I get my coke then? Okay. She's talking really negative. She's swearing. Uh, so our next crazy Karens get into a very heated confrontation at this event. 
de Shakira. ¿Saben que le robó el asiento a una mujer embarazada mientras fue a baño? Ella habla español y entiende. No, no está bien. Yo entiendo. Ellas también well, deberían okay, lugar. Right no. Estas dos señoritas. No te quedemos aquí. Vete, 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 vete. Vete, 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 vete.